One study looked at 266 uh, elderly and there was uh, over six to eight years. So we're looking at a very long time with a lot of people and showed a radical reduced uh, disease incidence and lower mortality when they were using uh, Timolin based on this once or twice a year protocol. Also helps with uh, neuroendocrine balance. What does that mean? So your hormones, the brain-based hormones, and helping with regulating your sleep-wake cycles and circadian rhythms, this helps. Uh, it helps reduce stress-induced immune dysregulation. How many people have that? Every night shift worker should be using this. Does that make sense? Do you hear that? Uh, it may also support grief processing and trauma recovery. Why did I just go through a round of Epitalian and Timolin? Because I'm in it. So the most important peptides for me recently have been Epitalian, Timolin, and Oxytocin because they're incredibly important when you're dealing with grief and dealing with trauma. So they aren't thought about as much for that and I really think that's a shame. More people need to know about them so they could be leveraging this. <clears throat> Timolin, timolin is very, very powerful, but again, it's not a peptide you just grab off of some, uh, you know, weird link on Telegram or some WhatsApp chat and you don't know what you're doing or where it's coming from. I would not recommend you just go rogue with this one, okay? Um, it is mostly sourced from international vendors and biohacker networks, so quality control really matters on this one. Be very careful where you're sourcing this. Uh, many guidelines are stemming from researcher recommendations. Please know there's very little FDA approval involved with this because, again, it's coming mostly from Russia. The Americans and the FDA have not gotten involved in Timeline. They don't really know much about it. I don't really care about FDA approval. That just means to me money exchanged hands. Don't doesn't mean anything to me, but some of you that matters. So if it matters to you, Peptides are just not benign. You must be aware of other medications that you're on and what you're doing and not be cavalier with some of them. This is not BPC-157. So Timolin, really, I love it. It's not about hype. It is something that we're controlling once or twice a year. It's here to help rebuild you.